Hello viewers, thanks for watching our videos. If not yet subscribe, please subscribe. So here in this module, we're going to discuss find the capacity of the tanks with the following internal dimensions. Express the capacity in cubic meters and liters for each tank. So they are given length, breadth, and depth. So they are given tanks like this. So what is that tanks here is? So actually length. Let's take length and breadth and height so these are the tanks like this so you can take tanks like this so tanks will be like this so this is length this is breadth this is height so let's take tanks like this and there so what is depth here height is nothing but depth height is nothing but depth next one so what we have to find is volume or capacity so capacity will use here so here will use for liquids that is liquid types volume will be used for solids so you can take volume and cubic meters that way so first one start with first one so length will be equal to 3 meter 20 centimeter then breadth will be equal to 2 meter 90 centimeter then depth will be equal to 1 meter 50 centimeter so volume will be obviously so volume volume for solids but here liquids so depth they are given for that it is liquids so volume for solids that will be equal to capacity for capacity for liquids so here what you can do here is capacity capacity will be equal to let's take length into breadth into depth so that is length will be 3 meters then breadth will be actually 3 meter 20 centimeter into 2 meter 90 centimeter into 1 meter 50 centimeters so you can do one thing here we can multiply with one values that is multiplying 3 meter 20 centimeter so what you can write 3 meter 20 centimeter 3 meter 20 centimeter we can write it in the format of meters only so that is 20 by 100 20 by 100 meters into 2 meters 90 by 100 why because 1 meter so therefore 1 meter will be equal to 100 centimeters so for that we are doing by into meters into 1 meter 50 by 100 meters so what it will be is what you can write here as 3 plus 20 by 100 will be 0 0.2 if you do well get into 2 plus 0 0.9 into 1 plus 0 0.5 meters so that are the values we will get so what it will be here is 3.2 into 2.9 into 1.5 so finally what you will get here is 3.2 into 2.9 so what you will get 9.28 into 1.5 into 1.5 so what you will get 13.92 meter cube so that is the capacity 13.92 meter cube so meter cube then what you can write here as so one meter so we need to convert this into liters so therefore since what you can write here is one meter cube equal to thousand liters so we can convert thousand liters that is 13.92 into thousand liters why because here one meter cube is there then this one three zeros are there one three nine two zero liters so what is that thirteen thousand nine hundred and twenty 
liters thanks for watching please subscribe so our second one is what is our second question is so length breadth depth that are given again we have to find the capacity for this so what is that capacity is so capacity will be equal to length into breadth into depth so before going to that convert this length will be so l will be 2 meter 50 cm so what is that is since 1 meter will be equal to 100 cm correct so here we are going to convert that one 2 meters plus 50 by 100 meters so we are converted 2 meters plus 0.5 meters that is 2.5 meters is length so like that we need to convert the remaining values also so breadth will be equal to 1 meter plus 60 centimeters then 1 meters plus 60 by 100 meters so 1 meter plus 0.6 meters then what will get breadth will be 1.6 meters then next one is what is our next one as depth so depth will be 1 meter plus 30 centimeters then 1 meter plus 30 by 100 meters then 1 meter plus 0.3 meters then 1.3 meters that is depth so capacity c will be equal to what is that length will be 2.5 breadth will be 1.6 depth will be 1.3 so what you will get 2.5 into 1.6 so 2.5 into 1.64 into 1.3 that is 4 into 1.3 then 5.2 what you'll get meter cube so 5.2 meter cube so 1 meter cube as a told therefore since 1 meter cube will be equal to 1000 liters so here 5.2 meter cube 5.2 into 1 meter cube then 5.2 into 1000 then what you'll get 5 2 000 that is 5200 liters so that is the answer so finally capacity will be 5200 liters thanks for watching please subscribe so in third one they are given length breadth height depth so for filling capacity for that so length you can convert it into so l will be equal to 7 meter plus 30 cm so as i told 1 meter will be equal to 100 cm so 7 plus 30 by 100 meters so 7 plus 0.3 meter that is 7.3 meters so that is the value of length then breadth will be equal to 3 meter plus 60 cm so 3 meter plus 60 by 100 meters then 3 plus 0.6 meters that is 3.6 meters so that is the value then depth will be equal to 1 meter plus 40 cm so 1 meter 1 plus 40 by 100 meters then 1 plus 0.4 meters that is 1.4 meters so what is that they are asked is capacity so capacity will be equal to length breadth depth that one is the length breadth depth so let's take what is our length will be equal to 7.3 breadth will be equal to 3.6 then depth will be equal to 1.4 meter cube so meter cube so what value we will get so 7.3 into 3.6 that is 26.28 into 1.4 meter cube so 26.28 into 1.4 so 36.792 meter cube so as i told so 1 meter cube since 1 meter cube will be equal to 1000 liters so we can convert 36.792 into 1 meter cube then 36.792 
into thousand liters. So finally, thirty-six seven nine two liters we will get. That is thirty-six thousand seven hundred and ninety-two liters we will get. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.